What up folks, bring you another one. Now this one I'm calling, women don't need men anymore these days. Now the reason why I'm saying that is, a lot of women now here are doing this shit. They, they get it, I ain't gonna lie. They making ways for themselves, taking care of themselves, raising their kids by themselves and all that shit. So they really don't need a man. Like most women nowadays, they're gonna have a dog, they're gonna have a toy in the drawer, and if they might have that one guy that they might fuck here and there, but they might just fucking end up, if they want companionship, they're going to have another woman. And like I said, there's a lot of motherfucking chicks being lesbians now. So it's like, why do they need a man now? They got a fucking dildo in the drawer. They got companionship from another woman. And then they got their little dog in the house that they could play around with and maybe lick their pussy here and there. Who knows? But... There's no point of them to eat the man now. And this shit's crazy. They got their own little social group. They got their own travel group. They got everything. So it's like, there's really no need for them to be with a man. And they're also, I've been saying it for years too, that the roles have been reversing. Men are being women. And men are being women. I mean, men are being women. Women are being men. And this shit been going on, I say about 30, 40 years ago. It's, it started everything these programs and all this shit it's all been fucking speculated and talked about for years this shit's like been years in the making they wanted to, they've been dividing and conquer. I can't say they wanted they've been doing it dividing and conquer. now it's always men the battle of the sexes like I say men versus women women versus men I mean there's so many fucking complaint groups in these rainbow color shit MGTOW incel purple pill red pills black pill whatever the fuck you want to call it i don't know that shit i don't care to learn about it either but the thing is men are doing all this extra shit for no reason because like i said a lot of women are doing this shit on their own they don't need men anymore so all this extra activity and curricular activity men are doing now it's not even needed anymore because the reason why i could talk about this i'm a field operator i'm out here in the fields the bar and i talk to a whole bunch of people and it's just like damn they all are saying the same thing and I'm about to make another video on perception and dating, but the thing is, why would a woman want to be with a man that's going to treat her bad, all this extra nonsense, when she could pay her own bills, wash her own ass, please herself, and have companionship with another woman? Why would she go in, be with a man, and have the headache? So it's just crazy that there's just a lot more women don't need men no more. There's a lot more single women now. So it's like, even if you are on your game, you got your shit together, some of them still will fuck with you, but a lot of them won't because they already have a perception of men. They don't like men for this, that, or whatever. Basically, they see all men the same. So even if you are that motherfucker that's doing the shit that will treat her right, she ain't gonna give you the time of day because she already has a perception of you and it kind of disqualifies you automatically. So she's just gonna stick in that mindset, like, why the fuck would I go out with this guy that might cheat lie some bullshit on me when I'm, I'm fine by myself i can handle everything on my own and boom so it's like nowadays the dating game is even more complicated because all this extra nonsense going on but i ain't gonna talk y'all head off i'm gonna holler at y'all keep pushing through the bullshit peace